you have your world converted into pocket edition. <laughs> Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back again to another awesome Minecraft video and today guys we are inside of Minecraft Java Edition and today I'm gonna be sharing with you how to convert your worlds from Minecraft Java Edition which is what we are currently at to Minecraft Pocket Edition or actually Minecraft so this world is an incredible world made by Jerocraft he's an absolutely ridiculous builder he makes builds like crazy big and that's actually really crazy so you should go ahead and definitely check him out but today um we're gonna be converting his map which is this one which looks absolutely gorgeous i don't even know it's like beautiful look at these like awesome custom made trees like these chains that are coming out of the ground it's like absolutely great and crazy and stuff like that and uh, it's really good i really do like this map so let's go ahead and turn it into pocket edition okay guys so currently i am in minecraft beta 1.2 build 3 which is absolutely great and really awesome i really do like this update and uh, as you can see i just uh, created the world a while ago and this is a completely normal world it is completely survival no cheats nothing you don't even need any of that things so as you can see i'm inside of this world and um I just want to point out now I have an awesome cape but anyway guys you want to actually make a blank world doesn't really matter whichever world it is you can actually convert the map into any world doesn't really matter so you don't really need to create a world if you have already made a world so you don't need to change any of the settings anything like that but you want to download this um, tool from the description down below it is called MCC tool chest PE you really you want to download it I'll leave a link in the description down below so you can download this map actually it's not a map it's actually a tool so you want to click on this file and then open it or you can just click on this open folder button up here it will show you the list of maps which you have in your minecraft pocket edition world or uh, actually minecraft world so you want to click on the world that you want to convert it to so the one i made is called ocean monument ahead i just the pick the seed so you gotta give it a little bit it will load up the world and everything's here you can change the data you can give your player some items as you can see let me actually show you you can actually go ahead and give your items like you can just drop and drag yeah, just items in your inventory you can even put items in your head and stuff it's really cool so you definitely want to download this tool but to the right now we are going to be going towards these uh, options up here and you want to click on tools and then you will see a convert button and also well, i just want to point out that you can convert from pocket edition to pc as well which is awesome but right now we're going to be converting from pc so you want to click on that and it will give you a little bit a little pop-up here which you can choose your world as you can see why this folder you can choose your world and this is the world we're gonna be choosing frosted skies and if you have like a different world it's like somewhere else you just want to click on it and then select a the folder I don't know just go to your desktop or whatever you just find the find the file and you gotta choose the level dot data folder so it's it's you will figure it out so you want to open up this thing and then right here it will give you some options so you can convert the only the overworld you can also convert the nether and also the end so you can convert all of them or if you don't want to you can convert the only the overworld but if you add any of these it will take longer so i don't really know you can include blocks entities such as beds and stuff or just entities uh, like creepers and stuff as well and also you can replace blocks so as you can see right here it says replace blocks and replace biomes but if you really want to like i don't know change all the wooden slabs into whatever you really want to so you can see you can choose like you want to turn all the wooden slabs to purple blocks you can do that if you really want to and you can choose whatever you want this is the list of blocks that pc has but on pocket edition 1.1 doesn't have because this tool is for 1.1 so I, I know that we have banners i know we have stained paint glass and stuff but yeah so you can do this and then you can click ok if you change something and you just want to click on convert as you can see it shouldn't take super long it is converting so many chunks at a time but let it just finish for a second okay guys so this took a little bit less than 
in minutes so it is actually pretty fast but as you can see it converted 12,000 chunks which is absolutely insane I don't even know it's uh, it's, it's ridiculous so it just converted the thing you want to close out of it and here oh okay so now it's just a lag you just want to wait for it 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 does it every time you just close out of it so just wait for it and then you want to make sure to click the save button once you've saved it you can uh, put it down and now if it hasn't load up as you can see now it loaded up so either you want to restart minecraft or uh, just uh, as you can see what what it did so you want to do that and right now uh, we died because it changed the world so let me actually change my game mode to creative so we can take a look at it so as you can see now I am in creative mode and also let's change the time so slash time oh time and just set it to daytime so there we go we changed the time to daytime and as you can see we have the exact same world inside minecraft pocket edition and it is actually really huge this map is ridiculously big and um we couldn't see much of it in java edition because i had my render sense set to uh i think it's like 10 chunks so it's not a huge it's not super huge but right now I am at 16 chunks right here so it's a bit higher so you can see more of it at the same time but as you can see this is absolutely huge and also the cool thing is like let's actually find one of these chests as you can see it has some random chests but it also uh, includes all in the stuff that are in the chest so as you can see it has the items inside the chest which is absolutely great and awesome it's it's really good converter so there are not many glitches with it so you can see it has the items and everything inside of pocket edition okay guys so i really hope you enjoyed today's tutorial um i'll make more tutorials in the future but for now that's all i've got time for today so i hope you enjoyed it be sure to drop a like and look at my cave that's awesome